When I was young, being a blue collar kid, I thought there were only two real jobs in life. One either became a lawyer or became a physician. The crystallizing moment in my life when I decided to become a physician was when I had the opportunity to meet a group of the most prestigious lawyers in the state of Rhode Island through uh, the debate team. They only talked about the economics of their profession. And at that moment, I realized I wanted something a little bit more human and decided that I was going to become a physician. I went to Brown University in my home state of Rhode Island, and there I got an undergraduate, a graduate, and a medical degree. From there, I had the opportunity to go to San Francisco, where I met my best friend and partner, David, and did my radiology residency fellowship and stayed on staff running the MR research and development facility as well as being a neuroradiologist at the county hospital. I actually stumbled into radiology. Uh, one summer I was looking for employment. I tried to get a research grant, which I didn't get, and instead I was offered a job doing research in nuclear cardiology. Uh, there I met a brilliant young Israeli physicist who told me about this up-and-coming technique that could eventually become something in radiology called MRI and thereupon I decided to embark upon a career of radiology. I moved to Las Vegas to rejoin my radiology residency friend uh, David. Uh, we both decided we wanted to move on to private practice and his father Leon offered us the opportunity to take over the new office that was going to be built at Maryland Parkway. Coming to Las Vegas gave me the opportunity to bridge my academic and clinical careers. While here, I kept my academic appointment at UCSF and with the research and development facility for more than a decade. That allowed me to continue to research, publish, lecture around the world, but at the same time bring these new technologies to Las Vegas for the people who live here. Dr. Winkler, from my entire MRI staff and myself, congratulations on winning this award. We're all very happy for you. Big shout out to Dr. Mark Winkler. I love to see good things happen to good people. This is one of those times. Congratulations on the Las Vegas Heels Award. Great job. It's my pleasure to congratulate Dr. Mark Winkler on his award. This has been a long time coming. I couldn't be happier for you. Congratulations, Mark, from the bottom of my heart. Congratulations, Dr. Winkler. Congratulations, Dad. I've been very fortunate in addition to having a clinical career here in Las Vegas for 30 years, I've also served as the advisor to Canon Medical Systems in the United States. In that capacity, I've been able to bring the best technology to Las Vegas. Outside of work, clearly the most important thing to me in my life are my wife and children. The family and I love to travel. We love to hike and we love to take care of our dog. The person I look up to most in my life is my father. He communicated very clear values that have helped me lead my life. We've had a long-standing association with the Pakistani medical community. We've trained more than a dozen physicians from Pakistan on the latest technologies, including MRI, CT, and PET. Reducing radiation exposure to our patients has been a priority for SDMI. More than two decades ago, we switched to Canon CTs, which have the lowest dose exposure of any CT scanners. More recently, we've switched out our general radiography equipment to also move to the most dose efficient equipment in the industry. What does the future hold? Well, other than the unknown, uh, in my personal life, my twin girls will become teenagers, which I imagine will be quite traumatic. Uh, on the professional side, SDMI plans to continue to grow at an office in North Las Vegas, make significant improvements uh, throughout our MR portfolio, as well as introduce some new but yet to be named secret advancements in pet technology in about a year. Mark, I want to congratulate you on being one of the six inspired nominees. We've been partners and friends, you know, for, well, since we started our residency, I value you as both a friend, a mentor, and as an expert. And I, I want to wish you uh, much happiness and congratulate you. Really want to celebrate with you tonight uh, on this uh, marvelous honor that is so well deserved. Congratulations, Mark.